today, I'm going to show you guys five very, very useful things in Blockstreet's PvP. So let's go. Make sure you leave a like, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, join the Discord, link in the description below, and let's get into it. All right, at number five, I think I've put this in many, many videos, but we have the pilot helmet. All right, so the pilot helmet is a rare accessory, and it just, it's so OP, bro. I think it gets dropped at the port town boss. Look how much speed it gives you. 130% faster run speed, 10% increased health gen, and 250 energy and health. 130% faster run speed for a rare accessory. If you pair this with Mink, like I say in literally every single video mentioning the pilot helmet, it is so OP. But if you don't have Mink, it's even more useful. So pilot helmet, it's basically a Mink if you don't have me well if you have like angel or something and say you want a little extra speed well a little bit say you want 130 percent more speed you just swing the pilot helmet on and now you are insanely fast and you still have the healing abilities of angel pilot helmet it's just really really good i really recommend it for pvp especially if you're using mink and yeah that's all i have to say about that before we continue the video guys do you guys want a free perm fruit i know you guys heard free perm fruit you but if you do want to enter a perm fruit giveaway, all you have to do, like the video, subscribe to the channel, and join the Discord link in the description below, and you have entered this giveaway. And that's all I have to say to you guys. All right, the next thing we have at the number four spot is we have portal fruit. All right, so portal fruit, this is specifically for bounty hunting. If you use the C move, you can go to whatever island you want, attack whoever you want, wherever they are, you just go over there, you hit a combo, you kill them, and then you can do that at the next island and just keep doing the same thing. Very overpowered for getting bounty. Yes, Highly recommend it. And that's not all either. Portal is not just for bounty hunting, of course. This is a PvP video. The X move parallel escape, it hides you from the enemy very well. So when they're about to use a move, you can just escape. Nope right they don't know where you are you can catch them and hit your combo it is just an amazing fruit all around coming in at number three we have the spiky trident it's the most useful sword in the game let's say you were sword main right you can go right there hit them with the combo easily right you can pull them back boom they're dead if i actually hit that and i didn't have a skill issue oh brother this guy stinks if you're fruit main, you can also use it for a combo. You can pull them back, boom, go straight into your combo. It's just the most versatile sword in the game. And I have to put it on this list for that. It really just goes with anything, bro. It goes with anything. You can use it in any stat, and it's just such a reliable sword. So yeah, that's why I have it at the number three spot. And moving on to the number two spot, we have Ken Trick slash Observation Tricking slash whatever you want to call it. Just dodge Ken, uh, but don't use Ken. What? So basically, you just want to keep your kin off right until you really need it or to find out where the enemy is. So let's say you're over here. You'd use it for a second, see where they are. They can try and hit you with whatever they want, right? But as soon as they hit you with something that doesn't break observation, all you have to do, turn your observation on, dodge nope. it, and counter combo. Maybe, you know, close the distance, whatever you need to do, really. Kin tricking is a very, very useful thing in PvP. I wish I could show you with somebody, but as you can see, we're alone here. Coming in at number one, the most useful thing in the game to me for PvP is the Rumble Fruit. Rumble Fruit, you can use it for sword, gun, and it's an amazing, amazing, amazing fruit, right? And it's just really, really good. And for, for fruit stats, I heard it was very, very OP. I barely used it for fruit stats, but I heard it was OP. It, it just seems OP because it does a lot of stun and does a lot of damage. But even without all that, it's still really good. It definitely deserves to be on this list for sure. So those are my top five most useful things in PvP. If you did enjoy the video, make sure you leave a like. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Join the Discord link in the description below. Don't forget to enter the giveaway. And I will see you guys next time.